Hey, good afternoon, Artists of War, and welcome back. In today's video, uh, we will uh, solve inequality uh, problem. Uh, what we have here is minus 2 times minus 5 plus m, and this sign is, is a greater than. So, in inequality uh, expression, uh, we use a greater, like as you see here. So this sign you see here is telling you whatever in the left side here uh, is a greater than 18. And that's how we express inequality. Uh, if you go back and see the word inequality, you hear this word somewhere. Uh, in social justice and all these things and what is telling you when you have two numbers we can express that they are not equal and that's how we say it's a greater than so you have the number is lower than another one and that's what is mean as you see here this sign is say is a greater so that's how we say it, it's greater than is mean that uh, 6 is greater than 5 so if we want to do that so uh, we say 6 and then we put uh, this uh, uh, sign it says greater so and then we can put 5 if the number is less like we say uh, 5 is less uh, than 6 in the same way we say is a greater and then we say less we can use the same thing on the same numbers if the number is a greater or equal and this is a sign we do so it's a greater and then you have here on you know underscore here and then this mean is a greater than or equal to and we're going to see we're not going to see all of these but if if you came across the ones look like this uh, that's mean that the number is a greater or equal to you know and as you're going to get some of the problem uh, expressed in that way it says a greater or yeah what, what they call a greater or equal to the last one here is saying it's less or equal so you're going to find a number that is saying this number is less than or equal to. So that's how you uh, deal with it. Let's go back to our problem. Uh, I wanted to let you know before we go to solve this problem, is the one thing you want to know. And it's very important uh, when you deal with an equality problem. As you can see here, what we saying that the number on the left is a greater than 18 and we have the sign of greater one of the situation where you are going to change this sign and I'm going to say a direction of the sign here is when you divide it so there's a two condition where you're going to see that you're going to change the sign of the greater or less is when you divided that number to minus if you divided any of these numbers to minus the sign here is going to change if this was the greater is going to change to less if it was less is going to change to greater keep that in mind where you when you solving this type of the problem inequality problem and that's what I'm going to do here to show you today and so you can know when you multiply anything in inequality problem you're going to change the direction and this is what what i done here so there's two conditions where you change the direction is when you multiply with minus or you divided the whole thing to minus the sign is going to change i'm going to repeat it because next time when you see something like this you remember Okay, so I'm trying to change the sign because we have a minus, minus 2. 
So you multiply by a minus 1. So you're going to multiply 1 on the left was minus 1 and then 1 on the right to minus 1. And that will give you change the direction. As you can see, like I told you, when you multiply or divide it. So we have right here, because we multiply uh, both sides of the equation here to minus 1, the minus 2 is changed to be a positive, and you know that one. Because when you multiply the, the negative to the negative, it changed the sign to the, to the positive. And that's what we've done here. So what left over here is 2 times minus 5 plus uh, m, and it became a less. So the 1 on the left side, it became less than minus 18. How we get to minus 18? Because we multiply a both sides of the equation to minus 1. And then we want to simplify it, so we're going to divide it, the whole side or both sides of this equation to, my, uh, to 2. And when we divide it, uh, the whole equation or this problem, uh, we divide it to 2 here, the 2 will go with 2, we cancel those 2, and then we, when we uh, divide it 8 minus 18 to 2, we get minus 9. So the new equation or problem, it became minus 5 plus m less than minus 9 as a result. And then we add 5 to both sides of the problem. So minus uh, or negative was a positive 5. It became a 0 on the, on the left side. You live with m. And then when you add minus 9 to, to 5, it became minus 4. And this is your answer. So the, the last answer or the final answer, m is less then minus four and you can check uh, but that's the right answer uh, so what i can say here even if you did not uh, multiply this problem to minus one you still get minus four because if you divide it two minus two or 18 to minus two you still get minus four and that's the right answer thank you